everybody. How's it going? Welcome back to the Daily Scrolls. What do I could? Scroll saw working. Scroll saw portrait design and woodworking. Uh, doing some more uh, work in the shop. Hey, hello, hey, hello, hey, hello, 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 hello to everybody out there in the chat. Ah, Steve, Larry, Larry, Pat, uh, Jason, Robin, Jerry, Herb, Art. What's going on, everybody? We all have to. What are y'all up to? Let me know. Let me know what you're all up to. Hey, Greg. Hey, Greg. So, what do you guys all, uh, doing tonight that you weren't doing this afternoon Cut out you good gnomes. Are they Steve good gnomes or Steve bad gnomes? Are they evil gnomes? Steve evil gnomes? Bob was probably trying to clean up her paint this afternoon, aren't you? Aren't you? All right, I have a question for everybody. So, for my uh, ornament here, Uh, let me change patterns for a sec so I can show you what I'm doing here. For my ornament, I need some constructive criticism on whether I should stain part of this or not. Okay. There's the ornament as it is. Now, this ampersand... is inset into it. Flush, right? Now the words Christmas and their names go over top of it. Now my biggest question was going to be should it uh, should I stain either the backer or the words of this and the 2022 is going to go in here by the way or should i just oil it the way it is even though so you're gonna have the same color layer on top of the same color layer The 2022 will be dropped down a bit more, though. Doug. Well, it's good to hear Larry. Hey, JJ. It's good to hear Larry. At least people are being productive while they're on my show. <laughs> Doesn't matter whether you like it or not, it's in there. It's done. <clears throat> what color would it look like being oiled? Um,
that's what I was thinking. Uh, so I was thinking is stain. Hey, Steve. So either either the backer will be stained or the letters will be stained. <clears throat> Here, I'll, I'll show you straight on. Why don't you like the ampersand, Robin? If you don't like it, you should have said something yesterday that you didn't like it. This is how I do all my. This is my style of doing all my stuff, right? Well, you didn't voice it loud enough yesterday, then. But this is my this is the style I do all my stuff in, though. All my wedding signs are done like this, and everybody loves it. everybody loves them. Ah, give me a second here. So if I go with, uh, I was gonna go with Sedona Red. Just give me a second here. I'll do a piece. <clears throat> so there's the red. There's the red, so it would look like that. <laughs> Larry, you're funny. No. Or if I stain the letters on to the oiled backer, put the 2022 over top of it like that. This will just give you an idea of looking at it with the letters on the back. The, It's not pink, it's stone or red. Uh, the ampersand is already inset into the backer. See, Robin, this is why you got to watch the video from the beginning. So, the ampersand. The 
is already cut into the backer. <clears throat> so oiled backer, red words. It's already inset into it. <clears throat> okay, oil back or red words done. Well, that's what's gonna look like when it's done. Hey, Connie, how's it going? Thank you, Steve. Okay, red. Red words. Okay, I'll oil the backer and red words done. I'm not changing it. I'm not going green. I'm not going blue. Red's your choice. <clears throat> no, and, and the, the the red stays that color. It's the donor red. It stays that color. God, you people. You people are hard to please. <clears throat> I just did you a sample. There's your sample right there. I'm not cutting letters out anymore. See, I think the white the white lettering on the red backer looks better though. It's oiled, it's oiled right there. Otherwise, it's going to look like 
that the red and black factor. All right, let's go with uh, let's go with the red backer. Uh, yeah, the 2022 is already black, Robin. As you can see, it's already black. Hey, Ken, how's it going today? <clears throat> okay, red backer. Red backer, let her stay white. Done. You guys are so hard to make happy. <clears throat> oh, you thought that was paper? You well, what you what you've been watching me all day today, and yesterday as well. Okay, once this goes on, it's on. It's done. I'm gonna give you the old, the old, the old Robin. Well, I don't like it. I've done this right, you know that. Too late. Red's going on. It's on. Yeah, I know. That's what I just said. Dean, you guys thought I was argumentative today. Or sorry, Doug thought I was argumentative. Hey, Denise. <laughs> well, control is always better than uh, anarchy. Come on. We all know the hats. <laughs>
now red backer now my inlay just drops in like so oh i forgot to do that centerpiece all right because i cut that centerpiece out earlier i dropped it back in now i gotta stain that too It's minus 19 right now. No, I'm not making them the white. They're staying they're staying plain. Plain old plain old Jane old white. Plain old Jane old wood. <clears throat> if I was making them white, that means I have to paint them. I don't paint wood. Natural looks better than anywhere. No, there's not room for it. It's already die cut, Robin. <sighs> can't change it after it's already done because I can't die. I can't re die cut the wood. <laughs> uh. 
this thing about woodworking, Joe, as opposed to crafting, is that once it's done, it's done. If I just leave the 22, then I need an apostrophe for it, though. That'd be too hard to put in there. So it's a simple, quick Christmas thing that somebody asked for on Friday. So if I was going to put more work into it. Well, that's why I just asked for a simple suggestion. That's all. Look what you guys made it into. <laughs> that's got to drill a hole up top. And uh, you got to paste wax this, oil these, put a hole up top, and glue it all together. Well, you guys didn't complain about it yesterday when you saw it there. Wait. <laughs> I still got to sand these off anyway. <clears throat> Let me uh, paste wax this though. Oh, you're hilarious! Oh, I guess I gotta go with Cabernet. I'm gonna go with Cabernet. It's a, it's a little redder. <clears throat> we'll see what Cabernet would look like on this then. So this side Sedona. We need to cavern over here. So there's there's between Sedona and Cabernet. That's oh, fine. No, I don't have white stain. Hey, Billy.
<laughs> no, I don't have Merlot or Shiraz. Okay, that's me a mistake. My dye, my black dye is not set yet. Just let me pop it out before I paste wax this. Oh yeah, Rob, what's your idea? I know our next comment is going to be like, I don't like it. Hey, hey everybody. Going? What's up, Johnny? Yep. Oh, not much. Just catching the slack from everybody out in the chat. <laughs> Who else is here? Just me? Yep. What? Yeah. I'll be doggone. Hello, fellas. And ladies. Believe it or not, I just was out there in the shop doing a little scrolling myself. What? Yeah, yeah my wife put me to work. Doing something? My wife put me to it work. It did not hurt you one bit. <laughs> You get your back's all your back's all sore. Well, to tell you the truth, it is because. Uh, what for the golf cart? No, from uh, doing the uh, um, birthday party uh, oh, no. Saturday morning. Uh, they were at a, 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 a flip and flip place where you do tumbling and stuff, and you know the floor is all padded and everything, but the main part of the floor where you go up and do all the stuff is thicker padding, taller. And uh, I saw it going up, and I knew it was there. But after I walked back down, I missed that dead blasted step, and I went face first, uh, tumbled over, landed on my back, spread eagle. I started laughing my tail off because I knew I messed up. And uh, today I got up, and my tricep on, on my left arm is hurting like you wouldn't believe. The oh forearm on my right arm is killing me. And my back's on my side. Is, oh, that, that, it happened from that tumble. It, there's nothing else it could have been. But I'll tell you what. I'm feeling it today. It's hell getting old. I don't like it. Oh, yeah. Of course it is. Uh, Wade, absolutely not. <laughs> I am not doing no tumbling. I wasn't tumbling then, but uh, only, only by accident. Oh, uh, don't even think about that. I have to... Uh, too much in the front to uh, 
balance. <laughs> I go right back over. That's one way to. That's one way of saying it. That's the way I'm saying it too. I knew. I, I let you have that one because I knew you would think that way. <laughs> uh, Robin says nobody puts Wade in the corner. <laughs> well, he says if John scrolls tomorrow or Tuesday. I can be on the panel on Friday. Oh, no, he didn't. He didn't say Friday. Oh, my God. Oh, I didn't I make much of anything. Nope. Uh, no, Denise, the uh, the golf cart outside, We, my wife, we made the uh, the spinners for the, for the wheels okay. out of uh, their hubcaps, but we lighted them up, and, and she made it out of foam board and then put vinyl on it to... Uh, imitate uh, uh, peppermint but at the end of the night that that, that uh, foam board didn't hold up and stuff so I, uh, I cut some out of uh, eight uh, three quarter inch uh, Luan paling uh, plywood and uh, we're gonna see how that goes yes Steve it does it does beat the alternative but only slightly <laughs> It just looked like the bomb, though. <laughs> Wade, you do that when you get older, too. Yeah, you should call me Benjamin Buttons. Bottoms? Whatever his name was. Benjamin Button. Benjamin Bottom. Bottom. I think it was Benjamin Bottom. It was Benjamin Button, baby. Benjamin Button, I said first. So. It was Benjamin Button. All right, Benjamin well, I said it first. Bottom. I couldn't remember which Benjamin one it was. Benjamin Bottom. Hello, Shay. You're funny. I know. <laughs> yeah, Jen says that happens either way. That's what I told him, Jen. Raj, stop. Please. So I went outside and I had to cut. We bought a, a two by four sheet of uh, that cheap pl uh, plywood at Luan. Luan. It, I looked it up in the dictionary and it, the American pronunciation is Luan, which doesn't make sense to me. But uh, according, according, to the, according to the according uh, to the the dictionary, that 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 wood is from uh, the Philippines and uh, Malaysia. And uh, their pronunciation is uh, Lawan. Hey, Peter, how's it going? <laughs> did you see Peter's comment, Russ? I did not. Russ and uh, wife. Russ and wife. Uh, I see it now. <laughs> I should be charging a fee for this. <laughs> That's uh, uh, how's it going, Peter? Go, huh? What? You gotta leave now. Wade, Let's man. Here. Not Peter. Wade. Hey, Shay. Yeah, Jen. That's pretty good. You're pretty good at that. It's Hope and Sean. Christmas 2022. Oh, right this there. is cute. This one's cute. I'm sure John thanks you. Oh, it is. It's nice. <laughs> so I'm going to oil my letter for now. <clears throat> Ken, Ken Spencer says it looks great. What's he working Something on? Something that is sealed. sealed fra Christmas? Sealed fragile. Quit shaking oh, it. Is. She said quit shaking it. <laughs> oh, showing how, how fragile it was. It, it is fragile. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it looks like something you've done before. The the, the fragileness of. Fragileness oh yeah, I've something. made some thin stuff. Yeah. What the, what nah, color stain is that? that? Yes, I would. That's Sedona. That's Sedona red. Oh okay, I I, I, I knew it's some type of red. I just didn't know which one. Oh, I'm not cute. sure if I have that one or not, which but one? I've got one similar. What's it called? Huh? What's it called? What? The stain. Oh. Sedona Red. Oh, you want me to turn this where you can red. hear it? No. Well then, I'm not really. I'm like, I'm like. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, no, I'm actually going to fill the box. Spell. 
I'm gonna I, build a box so to sleepy. hold it. Well, Jen says she likes it. Not Jen, Denise. Oh, got Jen on my mind for some reason. Ooh, who's Jen? Oh, jeez, oh, yeah. here we go. Who's Jen? <laughs> she said, wiggle, 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 yeah. Uh, well, good night, Larry. He said, uh, he said he's off the bed, Larry L.C. We gotta go to the UPS store tomorrow. Yeah, I'm just gonna look at some box to hold this in too. Okay, Mark, I'll I'll take a look. I'll be back. You've been up to Peter, I haven't seen you in a while. No, Lee, I did not run away. I popped off to check a quick uh, PM. What's Robin's talking about? What kind of project? What are you talking about, Robin? That's what I'm talking about. Peter see what he was working on. All right, Ken, thanks for stopping by, by though. Oh, a studio project. Good night, Ken. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, a stupid project. <laughs> a stupid oh, studio that's the project. kind of project a it is. A stupid studio project. Oh, Jesus, God help me. Oh, Peter said he has a project. Peter says it's a surprise. I'll be surprised if I get it completed before December is over. I know that feeling. <laughs> <laughs> Rusty, I'd be surprised if you get it done on the whole year. There you go. That's my wife for me. <laughs> Doug says, laugh out loud, manhole cover. <laughs> ah, good night, Jason. Jason Rickerhoff is leaving us. Hello, Art. Promises, dang it, I'm too curious for surprise. <clears throat> Doug telling Robin that uh, he put up a short. I guess he meant Peter. Put your shorts back on, Doug. Boy, he's got your whole. Mark tells Robin, you're in the wrong place for impatience. <laughs> That's funny right there, Mark. I don't care what anybody says. Uh, 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 
stop. Uh, Lee's saying if Russ is MIA, we might need to send out a search party. Ha! <laughs> Something was to happen to me. Y'all see it on camera because she'd be whopping me upside the head. See, I made this whole bear today. I made this whole bear today. I didn't start selling it until I got up today. And, yeah. and I will also print... Yeah, Greg, to the moon, Alice. <laughs> well, Lee said he's working on a pattern design. I guess Jen's telling uh, telling Larry, you go too fast, it'll look like she made it. That inset instantly. Awesome. Now see there, that that looked pretty snazzy there, fella. There Doug go, says, "Yeah, like, Jen, he can't cut a straight it. line slow. It's hard to yeah. cut a straight line. It's hard to cut a straight line with a pair of scissors too." <laughs> What kind of pattern is it, Lee? A car? A truck? <laughs> Don't laugh, John. I'm scrolling, but I don't see anything moving. I'm not scrolling. It's my air compressor. I was trying to figure oh. out how I'm going. <laughs> okay. Turn this into a box. Oh. <clears throat> Jen says she's just got reminded she has to cut more suede fringe. She didn't finish yesterday. Mark says he got called down on his own live today for mentioning an F-100. <laughs> and I'm wrong with F-100s. I like them. As a matter of fact, I'm 
Well, no, not quite. It's Chevrolet. <laughs> but I'm close to an F100. As a matter of fact, this is uh, Bob Lee's truck, which I'm trying to get him <laughs> to give to me. Okay, give me a sec. I got to go to, uh, I got to go with my saw and I'll be back in a second. All right. Time's up. Ah, oh, you're making a locomotive, a choo-choo. Okay. They haven't made F-100s in years. Are you that old? Well, yeah, he's he's pretty close to that old. Old rascal. He'd be like, dude, I remember the F-1. <laughs> well, now, I wasn't around to be able to drive that rascal, but I, I probably could have rode in the front seat. <laughs> Rick. Hey, Lee, hold up your pattern so we can see it. <laughs> oh. Yeah. I agree, Mark. figure out how I want to do this, whether I want to make a stand out of it or make a box out of it. A box would probably be cooler. If it's like a, eh, a drawer. I just want to make it so they can display it though, uh, like either way. So, like, I still got to put yeah, it on to... top of it as well, though. So, so they can either have it as Hang an ornament. It. Yeah. Or they can leave it in the box on Stop. display, right? Well, if you make it like I put a stand underneath it, and, uh, how much how much is on the bottom of of uh, wood background wood you got left? Oh, I got a I got a hole. I got a hole in this piece. No, I'm talking about the, the one you already got stuck in there. Your piece. Do you have any? Uh, yeah. Is that all the way flat to the bottom of that piece of wood? Yeah. Okay, then uh, you don't have any. Well, you got wood left over. You could make a little stand, and uh, let that sit in it. And if you wanted to put the hole in the, in the ampersand, then you could still do that. And they, they could either leave it in there and have it stand up straight or hang hang that, uh, take it out and hang it. Yeah, like I said, you I, know can what build, I'm build, uh, I can build one of my, one of my fold, my, one of my collapsible stands, right? That I do. Mm hmm. Either way, uh, but uh, just making the making a indention in or, or a hole, not all the way through, in in that in that piece right there, to have that thing sit in it, it would still stand on its own. And then you could have that you could have it where it's removable, and pull that thing out with and hang it with the, with the hole in the top. Either way, just make your uh, if you're going to do it that way, though, I'd I'd try to make the the stand rounded corners and. Possibly even that one with rounded corners. Make it look a little bit 
better than just square it off. You got an idea of what I'm saying? Yeah, I know. Yeah. Either way. The easiest way to do this, though, is is basically um, just drill a couple holes in the back and have a dowel. You can do it right. Um, Where's my dowels at? Right here. Like even if you have dowels going into the back side of it, they'll, they'll always be shorter. You want mm-hmm. a ride? I'll take you for a ride right down the street. Let's stay there. Think you can find your way home? One, two, three. Oh, no, I just put them in the bottom. One, two, three inch. Three inch dowels in the bottom edge would give it a nice angle anyway. Yeah, that would work. <clears throat> Just uh, drill a couple, drill a couple quarter-inch holes in the bottom. The dowel going into it. That way, it'll stand like that. Go eat that ice cream. Right, and uh, there's some bluebell ice cream in the other room. That way, it's either a stand or you pop this out. Right. Yeah, you can do that too. Simple, simple. That'll work. That'll work easier. Easy uh, and quick. uh, You can cut them at an angle. Quick and <coughs> quick and simple. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll I'll stand them on an angle after. Mm. So I'll start them off at uh, three and a half. Steve Combs said, "Just do one hole in the center." You'd have to get that dead center probably for balance. No, I need two. Yeah, two because because that way I can drill the holes through the backer. And not go through the front piece. The front piece will be a stopper for it, yep. right? The front yep. piece will be a stopper for it. That way, let's go to the bottom at about uh, inch and a half off. Should be good. No. Uh, Hello, one Jeff. Inch, one inch up on the other side. The Quarter Dutchman inch. just showed up. Hey, Jeff. How's it going? Hey, Jeff. Uh, did you do your video yet? I didn't get a notification for it. Mark yeah, said, Mark. Uh, yeah, that's right. Right. yeah that, that's cool. Jeez. Chris Nealon Where's says, help, that? he's trapped in a never-ending game of Uno. <laughs> oh, my. I, I well know that one. I play that with the grandkids all the time. Uh, Jeff said he did it at 7 p.m. Central. Okay. So we go half inch over. Doug saying, was that parrot for Jerry? <laughs> Polly the parrot, Jen says. Jeff says, last three shows sucked. Not too bad, man. Jeff said he left at Jerry says, Polly the Parrot is what I named my business after. Jerry said he didn't have the Parrot logo for the first three years, though. He woke up and drew that that one day. Ah, Steve Combs is going tonight, night. Good night, Steve. Night, Steve. Have a good day tomorrow. You go back to that J-O-B in the morning, buddy. <laughs> Jeff says, uh, that's okay. He's taking a break from uh, 
from all this, I'm, I'm going to take some time off and do something different. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Nancy, I didn't know you were here. <laughs> Jesse is going to go find a warm place to surf. <laughs> Mexico. Go, yeah, Mexico. <laughs> Hawaii. Always going there. You said hello. Yeah, well, I must have missed it. Jeff said he's going to Hawaii in February. It's... Have fun, bud. Nice place. Expensive. Very expensive over there. Hey, Cuba was expensive. <gasps> okay, there we go. Two, two simple quarter inch holes. Yep. Front door rolls along like that. It'll be glued. Jeff said, uh, surf's up, dudes. <laughs> ah, you go every year. Must be nice. Well, Mark got experience over there. The most experience, expensive part of Hawaii is a place to stay. Get away from Waikiki and the meals are reasonable. Yeah. I stayed, uh, I think, three days on Waikiki and then we stayed uh, four days on uh, Maui, which is better, less touristy. That's on the Big Island, Kona. Daddy rents a, con a condo on in uh, Kona every year from a friend. Only missed once, huh? Billy's asking what the dowels are for, John. Dowels are for the stand. Simple, simple, quick, quick, simple stand. I don't know if you guys have never seen this before. <clears throat> so basically, so here you go straightforward right so now ornament got some cut border for the front piece and you get a backer backer's got two quarter inch holes in it that'll get glued to that this will stay separate so that they put it in there or take it out so what it, if it's in there and they want to display it on a table or something put a two quarter inch dowels in the back of it and they get blocked on the front piece there and it stands up on its own that there you are there you go simple Just done. A nice job simple simple easy stand done <clears throat> so i'm just going to take these dowels and just give them a little round over on the back side here <clears throat> jeff said he loves your work jen says it's fancy blue this glue this to this and then I'll uh I'll just round these corners off a little bit more just to get this yeah off of sharp. that's what I'm talking about see that's just quick thinking oh you know what actually after after I do that I'm gonna run uh, a quarter inch bit down down the end here one on each side mm. you know what I think I'll run them I'll run them top top to bottom so that way you can stick the dowels in there storage if you don't want to don't want to display it on the back side right that way mm. they'll be stuck there they'll be stuck down there on the inside make sense yeah it's a long way down 
That's not that far. Stop, Marley. I'll, I'll, I'll do it on the uh, drill press, though. Yeah. Uh, Greg said put the dowel in the pencil sharpener. <laughs> I don't see the necessity for that one. Oh, to round off the end. Jeff asked, uh, what size wood are you using? Uh, this is probably maple. Quarter inch curly maple that I use. Cut that out with. I don't think it's interchangeable, so it's just, Billy. It's stained and waxed. <clears throat> is the insert interchangeable something? Uh, this one? Uh, no. Because this is the first first time I've built one, right? If you want another, if they want one for next year, then I can just do one I can do one exactly the same or or the same same shape or whatever. As long as it's the same style, shape, whatever it is, then I can do that. Laser. What are you talking about? Laser, <laughs> laser cutter. <laughs> it says that's got right on it. That's what his laser cutter is. There's my laser right there. He said, hell, I'm thinking laser. Jeff said, "Get rid of his lathe." You thinking about getting a laser instead of a instead of? Ah, oh, I wouldn't do that. So that one's completed. It looks like that. Wait a second. Yeah, look at that. Perfect done. Jerry said he's got to get his laser in the house. It's outside. <clears throat> hmm. I can't see you getting rid of the, of, of the lathe. I don't want to put you on here, though. And the CNC router. Now, wait a minute. Explain. You're going to get a laser and a CNC router and get rid of your lathe? Huh. Is that what you're saying? Well, then. I can't say nothing about that. <laughs> I would too. Like I said, if he gets a laser, he have to be able to move it in and out. That's a little tough to do, depending on what what size laser you're talking about. <laughs> Mark says, "Come on over to the dark side, Jeff. We have cookies." <laughs> Jeff says, "So did anyone on here see me live?" The live show tonight. Nope, not me. I was busy. No, like I said, I I, I never got a call. I never got a uh, a notice. Notice, no notifications. I haven't been getting notifications for some folks for a while now. Why I don't know. Uh, Connie and Made Simple Streamyard, uh, Nancy Wayne, Nancy Mark. Nope, that's it. Nothing from you. <laughs> I got a dog behind me that's just irritating the holy crap out of me. Yeah, Mark said he was at dinner at that time. Jerry needs to make a new holder for the disc he was carving. They were slipping. Huh? See, it says the last video you put up was three days ago. You said you were only going on YouTube, right? Yeah, because it's like I said, the, cause the last video you posted was three days ago. Yeah, Mark, uh, that is my dog's job, Evan, and she does it really, really good. She tells me she wants something, but she never tells me what it is. Jeff says, well, what would interest people in programming that I might get more looks? 
Oh my God, YouTube. Well, it uh, kind of. Uh, Why does everybody think YouTube? The all the in thing people? about uh, a YouTube channel, and I think Doug can testify to this, is uh, if you put something on that channel that they're not used to seeing, they they don't like it. You you start losing subscribers. So if you if you put a a laser and a a, a CNC on, on your channel, they they're used to seeing your lathe work. They won't like that. <laughs> well, we wouldn't be saying that. <laughs> Jen's got blisters on top of blisters. Now, Larry said he was going to try to get a portable one, kind of like the You're laser, wrong, laser yeah. pecker. Yeah. Something small so he never use his phone or a USB stick. Timmy is in the well, Russ. <laughs> Don't make me laugh, uh, Greg. If your if your uh, YouTube show, Jeff, is is geared toward lathe work, and you want to try the other stuff, then you're gonna have to open up a new channel. I wouldn't mix it. See, Doug is right here. Doug, see, I've gotten spanked by my viewers for. Something other than resin wood turning. See there? Mark said, that's a mystery to us all, Jeff. If we knew what would attract views, we'd all have a million subs. <laughs> Nancy agrees with him. Doug says he's about to put more than just his lathe again. Uh-oh. Jeff said he, he has at times had more people, but I can't do that every time. It's too freaking old. <laughs> yeah, Billy said, yeah, he learned the hard way too. He had to open up a second channel. Hmm. Jeff, uh, Doug says he's got to mix it now. Can't afford to wait on a channel to maybe get monetized. Ha uh, ha. Jerry, the fastest way to get views is to hire someone to stand in front of your project and TikTok leggings. I am not above a little clickbait. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Jerry, 20 bucks is 20 bucks. Oh, yeah. We were, we were discussing that this afternoon. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> <sighs> <laughs> that's funny there's a lot of them out there already though Jeff yeah yeah there is <clears throat> well you know you could be like some of those channels that I've seen out there that uh, they have they have ladies in there with them working <clears throat> But they, you know, they're, they're dressed very provocatively. I would put it that way. But they're working. Provide, you know, I've seen them. I've seen them doing using sawmills, and and working on that and doing other kind of stuff. And it's just ridiculous how they're doing that. But they're, I guess they're making a making viewership. Mark says the people that like your videos will stay no matter what project you make. Some of them will always have an issue though, no matter what you do. Yeah, it just, well, according to what Doug was saying, it uh, it seems that uh, he put something, and Billy too, I guess, it, you you put something on your on your channel that they're not used to seeing and they don't want to see it, they get pissed off, and they'll leave because that's not what they came for. <laughs> I'll never be on the TikTokers. Yeah, it amazes. Nancy said it amazes are what, what people want to see. There are people watching other people scratch off lottery tickets because they think they know a, a, a plan. They have a, a secret to winning the lottery. Oh, my so yeah. they'll watch them scratch yeah. off yeah. Hundreds, right of, on the ship. He was hundreds of lottery tickets. He had lottery tickets he was scratching live. Who's that? Yeah. I don't know what his name is. He was on the, sh on the cruise 
Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's right. Yeah. I don't know what his name was. He's but that we guy. Were right next to him. He showed. He featured on some of his video. We got called old lady. We were in here one night. We were in here one night on the uh, hangout, and uh, we we're looking for something to watch. And I was going through the freaking TikToks or, or uh, Instagram. Yeah, you know, I think it was TikTok. No, it was uh, Instagram Live. This guy was scratch tickets. Scratch tickets was all he was doing. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm like, okay. Like, I don't know why. And then uh, I went to another channel, and this guy playing bingo. He was just playing. He was at. It was at a bingo hall, and he was just sitting there dabbing his. He was dabbing his freaking bingo ticket. I'm like, and people like would watch anything. Views. Yeah, they'll watch anything. And like live. I'm like, why are you watching this? This is not educational. You're not getting anything out of it. You're watching somebody. Yeah. Dab. Abazone is awesome. He's sitting there watching somebody scratch their tickets. And Jeff says Facebook has turned into that kind of stuff. <laughs> oh my God, Larry. Really? Larry spyware from Ca I don't China. To have it. It's spy software from China. Yeah. All the software is from China. It's on your phone, which is made in China. <laughs> it's all in there, Larry. Jeff says all of a sudden he sees like uh, 15 uh, live or, or women j are just sitting there talking or just staring at the screen. Have you seen that? I hadn't seen that. I wouldn't watch it anyway. Uh, Jerry says people watch kids open toys. There are a few YouTube children knocking down six figures just for opening toys. I've seen that, and uh, like the, 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 they'll, they'll go to the store. And, uh, well, it, actually, the, the parents have contacted uh, kid testers for the toys and stuff. Uh, mm. Small, small project, right? So they, they they get all these toys and then send them in the mail, and the kids just open them. That's all they do. They open them, they play with them, and then they give a little review on. It. That's it. That's all they do. That's it. Yeah, but they're 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 YouTube influencers. That's why they keep getting the stuff sent to them. Yeah, Doug's getting a ride out of Robin. <laughs> what makes somebody an influencer? I understand that. Uh, <coughs> yeah, uh, they get uh, to keep the toys too. Honestly, like, like, like honestly, what, what, what in somebody's illogical, insane mind? makes a kid an influencer for opening up a toy. It's opening up and playing with it. Tell them if they have fun with it. It's an influencer. Just like but them yet, uh, fancy little uh, hotshot girls yet, that do all yet, the trials. Working on projects. Gotta be a hotshot. But yet, me oh, working yeah, on a project, the... showing people start to finish how to do, how to complete something using logic and straight edges and rulers and math mm -hmm. that that wouldn't be an influencer because it oh sorry i i i i'm i'm influencing creativity and that's not what people want people want instant gratification yeah yeah you know, that's matter. exactly what it is robin you don't do the try-ons that uh i'm talking about oh no yeah robin you don't do those try -ons. You don't you don't do the try-ons where you know lingerie and and beachwear and all that kind of stuff. Them girls are making the money. Mark said he had an yeah, idea for uh, a, a different type of fishing channel, but somebody already beat him to it. <laughs> Robin says she just got uh, stuff sent to her to do an unboxing. The uh, uh, cosplay girls. Uh, yeah, I I do have a couple people in my Instagram that are actual woodworkers that do cosplay as well, but they also have this, so they, they they got a TikTok <coughs> chat, they also have Instagram, and they got an OnlyFans, and it's hey. uh, it's, it's gone way too far. It's like really, like, like mm. you're 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 a woodworker, you get a reputation to think of, and this is what you're doing on the side as a as an OnlyFans page as well. Yeah. Jeff so, says, you guys are always welcome on his show. 
He loves to do a chat, you know, like you guys are doing, side-by-side -side chat. So you're always welcome, man, to and come in and feel free to criticize. But by God, you know, we, we love criticizing. <laughs> now, Jerry, what is Russell watching? So it is, uh, I'm trying to learn some of this stuff. The more, the more information I get from you guys, you're doing it all the time, the better off. And like I said, I want to say to be like Tim the, Tim the, it's, yeah, Tim the Tool Man Taylor. <laughs> I used to love that show. Is that the one that looks over the fence? Yeah, he's in the backyard though. Through the hole. We're not we're not talking about that part of it. He was talking about the Richard Carnes and and uh, Tim Allen but talking that's to the each one? other. Now, Lee says he's a YouTube influencer. Everest, my free stuff. I'm not sure exactly what that means. He says, where's my free? I don't know what that means. More power, Russ. <laughs> uh, come on. Yeah, I want more of the ice cream. I want ice cream now. <laughs> Thanks, Teresa. Maybe. <laughs> ah, you put the ice cream in, in uh, John's brain now. Oh, but you don't have bluebell. Yeah, you don't have bluebell up there, huh? No. No. Nope. Yeah, bluebell is, is no, the bomb. We got Chapman. We got Chapman. Yeah, don't have that down here, but we sure have bluebell. That <laughs> <laughs> right, Mark? That's right. <laughs> bluebell is the best. Billy Bird said he's a YouTube influencer. I influence his viewers to watch somebody else. <laughs> Mark says, don't go looking through fences. You'll end up on a registry someplace. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Lee says, where's my free stuff? I'm an influencer. Greg says, been for 6000 Yep. Jeff said he was going to do a garage show. <coughs> uh, now I don't know what he's going, where he's going with that uh, skin channel. Skin channel. That's what that's what Jeff said. Doug says blame people like Peter Brown, Nick Zametti, Andy Phillips, and. Heath Knuckles for, for getting me into this stuff. <laughs> Jeff says, I know who they hey, are. Peter, are you still here? <laughs> <laughs> who wants to watch the skin channel where I put uh, uh, working hands in my, in my hand? Yeah. Yeah. I understood that, uh, Doug. Herb's asking if Denise is still here. Oh, yeah. Uh, Wade says, Chuck Berry got sued for uh, Run Run Rudolph by the folks that wrote off Ru Rudolph the Reno's Reindeer, and he had to give them credit on his album. Well, I have no doubt of that. Jeff says, hey, you know, you, you could take tools <laughs> or modify them. That would be kind of cool. Don't stink kind of uh, like with uh, Buster's. Damn it. <coughs> he said he's always trying to figure out how to get something to have more power. More power. Boy, you, you would really be a good uh, Tim the Tool Man Taylor.
Mark said, is that why you put a Buick, Buick V6 in your dishwasher? Mm -hmm. I mean, he meant that for Jeff. <laughs> Jeff says, you all can send me an email if you want. What do you want it to say? Shay says, I'm just always trying to not light my surge protectors on fire. <laughs> she says, low power, low power. <laughs> low power. Yeah. <laughs> Jeff wants more power. She says, low power. Right. Oh, my goodness. The 12 volt. <laughs> yeah. Mark says he wants a riding rear bagging uh, vacuum cleaner for the house. Now, that would be funny to see. Lee says they're electric proof but not fireproof. You can email me or just Facebook me, Jeff said. Oh, my goodness. Wade said he put a V8 into a Fiero. Had one with a 3,800 uh, S. Ooh, no. Shay says she's managed to light a uh, surge protector on fire twice. Uh, that's, uh, How? <laughs> I don't know. Ask it's, it's Charles. He he, he, he did a hit surge protector up. It's supposed to cut off if, if it surges yeah. too much power. That's why they're called surge protectors. <laughs> Mark is saying that his vacuum cleaner would be a zero turn Hoover. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one there, Mark. Uh, he said that's a name for his uh, garage band, the Zero Turn Hoovers. <laughs> that's funny. Nice. Lucky the set of keychains ready to go. Outstanding. <clears throat> and he says, Still oh yeah, there's up. a way. Billy said he'd be right yeah. back. Still gotta finish up the uh, coast. Oh, or yeah. Or the Shea says, uh, if a blade drops in the socket, it goes up in flames. Yeah, you short circuit big time. Why would you drop a blade in the socket? It just happened to fall there. I thought you had, well, what happened in your jar? <clears throat> Pretty blades, Jeff. Golly. Shay says she has a jar, but the broken ones, while I'm working, get thrown on the floor. Well, <laughs> I wouldn't do that no more. Yeah, Shay, stop doing that. Four twenty-six. Ooh. Jerry said he put a chain on his bicycle. <laughs> Everybody else is putting hemis where they don't belong. And uh, Jerry says, well, I put a chain on my bicycle. <laughs> Was it a white bicycle? I have no idea. My white bicycle. Yeah. Jeff said his dad used to get pissed at him for taking things apart and modifying them. <laughs> oh, I'm just starting another project. <clears throat> oh, Lee's starting to sing us a song. I want to ride my bicycle. To ride my bike. Yeah. 
And by God, Greg wins the case. He said he hung an air freshener on the mirror. By God, you're the winner, buddy. That's all you did. <laughs> hey, oh, he's the winner. The Look at that. next week. Hey, hang on a minute. Let me see that. Uh, you got the uh, tinfoil on, buddy. Man, that looks yeah. pretty decent. That looks real decent. I like that. That is not something I would have thought of till you said it the other day. Well, I know Shay would never touch it. No. <laughs> <laughs> Shay would not touch this in her life. We're going right house for the uh, cruise. Yeah, <clears throat> yeah I still got to go down to uh, Michael's and see if they got buttons for these freaking uh, hubcaps. Yeah. I they made something pretty cool for that. But, so. They probably do. I'll take I'll take this to work with me tomorrow. If not, you could shape them, uh, couldn't you? Yeah, but I got uh, one, two, three. I got well, yeah, five of them. A bunch. Do, but I want to I want to <laughs> make them look. Yeah, I, I, like like I want to try and get as many holes in it as possible, right? And then I can shape them. But the thing is, I got a. <clears throat> that's what I was thinking. If I can get a button, like a metal button or uh, a metal door pull that looks mm -hmm. like that, about that size. You know that I could just put that in there. See, if mm -hmm. if I can get a metal door pull, that'd be even easier because then I could just put the bolt right through it through the back, and then the tire would still spin, right? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Wade's about to get uh, banned from this show. He says, "Think how good that wood would look painted." <laughs> uh, <not really>. <laughs> <sighs> So I got to do the back, the back or this will be black. And then, uh, like I said, I was talking with, uh, uh, who, whose truck, whose truck was that? That was, uh, who truck, uh, Larry. Yeah. Larry's truck, which is red and black. Right. So I'll do the truck like that. Red and black. You get the black background for that. I got to finish up, finish up uh, Ariel. <clears throat> Just got to figure out what colors I want to do Ariel in. <clears throat> it's just too. It's just too late to start start on this right now, though. So I'm going to do Ariel, and then uh, the rest of uh, her rocks and stuff. So those parts, I figure what I'm going to do for backer for those. i got to finish up Charizard. This all has to be done this week, by the way. So i got to finish up Charizard. The backer for him. i got to finish up. That's sweet. Finish up the Sonic and Tails. All that has to be done this week, right? Yep. You might have to do some of this off camera. Link. Takes too long to do <sighs> this on camera. No. Well, and the thing is, I know, I know this is going to be our last week for doing stuff out of town. So, which makes mm -hmm. it even worse because I know I'm going to be out of town at least three days. And so you're not you're not going to be here tomorrow night. I don't know. Uh, we were like I was supposed to go. I was supposed to go back to Rainbow Lake, where it was last. It's going to be just as cold, mm. not as cold. It's going to be still cold. But he's thinking mm -hmm. about sending us to uh, Dawson Creek. So and Dawson, ah. Dawson is going to take a couple of days because I got to do Taylor. And I got to do an Esso station in Taylor, and then. Uh, uh, pet store in Dawson Creek, and then send the guys, send the other guys up to Fort St. John to do a reed lamp at one of the hotels up there. Mm. Class five? No, it's a class one, man. It's got freaking, it's got double axle on the back. You class one for this. It's got air. It's class one. Come on, Wade. <laughs> So 
So, a whole group of projects that I got to finish up this week. That's a bunch. Yeah. This, this is why John has a hike unfinished scroll saw project. <laughs> but I mean, I, I, I think I did pretty good. I think I did pretty good considering I started, I pretty much started all these December 1st, right? Yeah, give or take, yeah, roughly. Yeah, I think it was the last, the, the last week of November I started all these, so that was pretty good timing. Jerry says the countdown is on. Someone is going to finish more projects this month than he has in the last year. <laughs> yeah, yeah, apparently I am. <laughs> Wait, says she's a fine piece of tail. <laughs> oh, my God. I, I shouldn't have read that one, but I, I thought it was funny. <laughs> so and then I still got to finish designing the uh, the overlay for Charizard. I got to finish finish the overlay for that one too, so that I can get the so I can get a graphics girl to uh, do the uh, the the clear clear vinyl printed overlay for it. Lee's, a Lee's asking if you're on tomorrow or if you're busy. Uh, I think you're gonna be out of town, right? And I'm not sure. I'm not sure whether I'm going out of town tomorrow. Like, uh, okay. like I said, he was gonna send us to Rainbow Lake, which is six, yeah. six, and, six and a half hour drive from here. That was gonna be at least one more until Tuesday, but because of the weather, we might be going to Taylor and Fort St. John instead. So I'm not sure. Mm hmm. Well, it's a. Uh... Give and take. We'll we'll find out. <laughs> Mark. I see that. Yeah, it was funny. <laughs> hmm. Jeff said he's on Tuesday, both on Facebook and YouTube. On Tuesday, both on Facebook. Yeah. So so Jeff. So tonight I, I didn't get a notification on YouTube, but it, apparently apparently you're on Facebook though. But I didn't get a notification on Facebook saying you were going live. But I looked at your channel. And you were live on uh, your channel. See, and I'm following. I'm following you, and so I should have gotten a notification saying you were live, but I didn't get one. Okay, Lee says, well, okay, if you're around, he'll be, uh, I guess, available Monday or Tuesday to come on the panel. Mm -hmm. Jerry's looks like he's booked up on Monday, but he's taking a couple of days off after that. Yeah, so I figure I'll be doing a couple late nights, but I got to find out what's happening this week in order to get through what nights are going to be on in here. <coughs> so. They'll be. I gotta get, like I said, I gotta get this stuff finished, and I still have to get over my table saw. I still have to get over my table saw and finish the trailer for this. But I don't want to. I don't want to cut out the backer for the trailer until I have the long pieces cut. Then I'll know exactly how long long they have to be. It's gonna be a big one. <laughs> yeah, that's probably true, uh, Mark. He's never gotten a notification about anybody going live on Facebook. He gets a notification that they were live. <laughs> yeah. Well, Jen says five blankets done, two more, and then a tree skirt to go. Well, I finished all my bears. Now I just have to finish the little odds and ends. So I'm good. And then uh, once I finish these all off, uh, once I finish these all off, I get started back on my stuff that I supposed to have been done two years ago. Uh. <laughs> Like the uh, aluminum memorial hearts for my brother. Those three with butterflies. 
Um, but here's, oh yeah, they're buried under the stack over here. And then I'll finish up, uh, oh yeah, then I'll finish up the, uh, the candy skulls. <laughs> yeah. I haven't finished those up yet. I'm still waiting on that dragon to come out of the egg. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Connie asked, uh, did you do the snowflake already? No, I haven't done it yet. I got, I, 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 I'm trying to read. So the snowflake, I'm, I'm actually trying to redraw that in Corel so that they're more, they're sharper lines. Um, I might just, I might just draw by hand, maybe quicker. I might just draw by hand and then, uh, scan them in. Hmm. Linda just got miles. finished leading 14 tile with the mini for youngest granddaughter. Now she has four half to do it since she finished. One of the seen my Robin from the fall way back when. Yeah, it looks like it's going to look nice when it's done. She got my people bringing me stuff for next year. <laughs> I do. I'm tired. I'm tired too. Thanks, Teresa. Yeah, yeah, she passed it on. <laughs> You're gonna hit me up a couple times. So I think I'm pretty much done for tonight, though. But uh, like I said, I'll figure out what my schedule is this week once uh, after tomorrow, and then I'll freaking just get started and just start doing all this stuff. <clears throat> so my labs will be Roger that. next. When, when I'm home, but I'll figure I'll figure out my I'll figure, find out my schedule for this week anyway. No, for a round, I'll try to keep you comfortable. And then on Saturday we got the uh, on Saturday on Saturday we got the uh, scroll off competition. Like I said, I don't, yeah, on Saturday. By the way, uh, I, I've heard it be known that you're going down. I can't say who. Yeah, that's what people keep <laughs> saying. <that we'll> <laughs> We'll, we'll see what happens. Uh, We're gunning for you, buddy. <laughs> well, because last I last I heard, he Just said he was going to be a, a commentator and instead of being actually scrolling. Okay. Who? Who was Charles. Charles? Really? Why? Yeah, he was saying yesterday. He was saying yesterday he might not even scroll. He might just be the mo a commentator. There's no reason for that. Well, Unless you're just him. giving up of trying to beat you. Yeah, we've been dogging him for so long now, right? <laughs> <laughs> I think he's going to scroll myself. I, I don't think he'll just commentate. I don't know. We'll Everybody find looks out. like they're getting we'll sleepy, huh? Yeah, yeah we'll see what happens. So, yeah, so we're, I'm tired right now, too. So, yeah. Okay, Robin, we, Robin has to work. She can't be there. Oh. On of work. Not a terrible thing. She can't be there. Not terrible. And yeah. Copyright infringement. Jeff says, well, he didn't, he, you know, Jan, it's not because he lost the last one. It's because he lost the one before that as well. Okay. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> ready? yeah right. That's how we dog him, but it's and all so, good. So he, he lost the last one. He lost the last one. The one before that was canceled due to lack of interest, and I won the one before that. So I'm a three-month holder of the belt, the imaginary belt. Yeah, yeah. We ought to make a make a belt. Hold on Pass a it on. I hold mail it to whoever belt. wins. Woo! Oh, I gotta hold my belt. There we go. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we ought to attach a little leather to it so we can just flow it over the shoulder. Oh. Jeff says, ever since they move stuff, I'm going around the pages. They mess with it. You don't get it anymore. I'm always having trouble. Plus, I'm getting docked for copyright infringement. See, so yeah, you're, you're, the copyright infringement you're getting docked on just it doesn't make sense to me at all. Mm -mm. <laughs> Mark says he's the body of a commentator. Yeah. <laughs> Billy's going to be out of town, so he won't be able to get in the scroller. 
And uh, Lee said he sent you the pattern he was working on. I guess you mean you. Yep. I, he sent me uh, was it five of them, four of them. Four or five of them, anyway. <clears throat> Ah, me. You sent it to me? I see you did. Ah, oh, that, that train. Let me look. I'd like to see one, two, three, four, five, six. That's a nice truck. All right. <clears throat> so let's call it for now. If anybody wants to chat with us, we'll be over the hangout. Yep. For a little yep. bit. A little bit. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> don't, he see. said he's not done yeah, yet. Don't try to scroll. Yeah, everybody thinks we're in <laughs> chat. And we'll. 30 of them. 15. Oh, shoot. Wow. Well, if I'm on tomorrow night, I'll be on tomorrow night. If people want to get back to you about what's going on, all right? Uh, do, 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 do. So have a